Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And, um, well, the um, problem with the local security authority uh, protection that uh, some people um, have seen in the past, um, a, a new fix has been actually issued uh, within the, na the last couple of days to uh, refix the problem for those that still had it. And uh, also it explains a few things. So of course, uh, the, sec the local security authority problem was um, with the, uh, the system uh, in the core isolation and you know, it would give um, a message that it wasn't turned on. And actually it's not a real message. It's, it's turned on and it does work. It's just that um, it doesn't show it correctly in the, uh, in the um, Windows Defender or Windows Security app. Now, the story behind all of this, because I've seen a lot of your posts and a lot of you don't see this section, local security authority protection is not there. And why is it not there for those that don't see it? Well, what happened is that Microsoft issued a fix when that problem arised. But the fix would actually create blue screens with some apps. So they stopped that fix from going forward. That fix actually had removed local security authority protection from the Windows security app so that it doesn't display the message. But because they actually stopped sending that update due to the blue screen that some people were having, uh, it left some of us with the local security authority protection still there and some of us with that removed from the system. So if it's removed, it's because you had that update that was actually stopped at some point. So apparently this week um, in the Windows updates, another update came through for the uh, protection, uh, local security authority protection fix. So apparently that actually was uh, now it's supposed to be now really fixed and okay and no more problems. Um, so whether you see it or not, it doesn't matter much. Um, if you don't see it, it's because you had that update that removed it. And if you see it, it's because you didn't have that update, but the new update should have fixed it. And anyways, the workaround that I did, that I made a video about, pretty much all of you that tried it, it's successful and it does fix the problem anyways. So anyways, it's a, one of those things that's so darn complicated for Microsoft to just, you know, deal with. But uh, it happens and uh, it is apparently gone and fixed and okay now and like i said if you don't see the local security authority protection don't worry it's it's fine it's 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 okay not to have it uh it's still there it's just that they kind of removed the section on some of the uh windows security apps if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching